What's going on guys? This is Tony here with BigBuildingsDirect.com and today I am standing in a completely finished, delivered, and installed metal garage done by us. We're gonna show you today how we did this from start to finish, installed, delivered in four days. Coming up. What's going on guys? This is Tony here with BigBuildingsDirect.com and today we're out at my farm and well, we're putting up one of our big metal buildings. Big barns actually. So if you're interested in getting in your own metal building, consider subscribing. We're gonna show you guys how we did this building. So in this video, it'll be showing you guys how we install one of our metal buildings from start to finish, giving you guys the information you need so that you can get the metal building of your dreams. Follow me. All right, guys, so real quick, we're gonna head back to where the project started, where the metal barn's getting put up. Pretty much the property consists of 36.3 acres. And why I bought the property is pretty much uh, for my family and friends to enjoy, and also to show you guys one of these big metal barns in action. I've got a one-year-old daughter with coronavirus happening right now. Uh, I think it's important to show her kind of the outside the city life pulling up to the project right now. All right guys, so in our last video, uh, we talked about the rat ledge on the building. Kind of showing you guys how we laid this two by four right here for a one inch drop down. And we've got the base rail laid out on the building right now. And what the base rail does is it kind of lays a map for where the skin of the building is gonna go. Where the base rail isn't is where the garage doors, the walk-in doors, things of that nature are gonna go. So what they've done here is they've cut out each section of where all of the garage doors are gonna go. And then we've got some framed openings for the inside of the barn. And then right here, you can see that the base rail lays right on this edge. And what we're gonna do later on, we'll show you guys a video of the skin of the building laying over this right here. So when it rains, nothing can come in. So we've anchored into the base rail. Anchors are placed every four foot on center for our building right here. This building is certified for 170 mile an hour winds, 35 pounds per square foot on your roof load. All right guys, so finished putting up the base row around the whole building and now what you can see is over here, we're starting to put the 16 foot legs in. As you can see, these are ladder legs, double braced, double anchored at the bottom as well. And then we have a 16 foot frame out right here. So starting to get the legs up, next is gonna be the trusses. Then after that, we're gonna start doing the actual lean tos as well. Kind of tell we've got about half of the trusses up we're wrapping up on day one right now just showing you guys kind of what the commercial grade trusses look like tomorrow we're going to wrap up the center section get the two lean twos finished up and probably even start sheeting so day two tomorrow we're excited What's going on guys, it's day two. We're out here at the property. We've got the end walls up, they're moving. They're putting the hat channels across for the vertical siding. We got all the trusses up last night. And then what we're also doing is we're putting hat channels across the whole entire roof there. That way when they bolt on the actual PBR panels, they'll be good to go there. We've got the header bars like I was showing you yesterday. Those are all up and then uh, Today, we'll be putting on the lean twos. I'll show you guys some videos of that coming up. And then uh, we'll put all of the lean twos up. Pretty much have the whole skeleton up today. And then tomorrow, we'll be doing the panels of the building. It looks like we're doing all vertical panels, vertical wainscote, 
and uh, stay tuned for tomorrow. It's going to be awesome. All right, guys, it's day three on the property. We're out here, the cows joined us back here. And what you guys can see right here is we have all the lean-tos done. They're, they're, ending, uh, they're putting the bracing on the lean-tos right now. We finished off this end wall. Well, we basically tacked it in. And then they're gonna come through. They're gonna put all the screws in the end wall. And then um, we're gonna start doing the roof on the building as well. Just to give you guys an idea on a building this size, it's 4,200 square feet, 16 foot tall. We ended up having to use uh, right at a uh, uh, little over 5,000 screws on this building. I just uh, had to purchase all the screws because we're going with colored screws on this one. So a little over 5,000 screws on this building and uh, it's an absolute monster. So. All right guys, so we're about to put the roof on this metal building, but before that, I wanted to show you guys, this is the ladder truss system that we're using on this building. It's called the commercial grade industrial truss system. As you guys can see, it's about one foot thick. It's got hat channels going across every three foot on the whole entire building. Then we can move over, check out these ladder legs. Once again, they are one foot wide and they are 16 foot tall. Just showing you guys kind of the rigidity of our commercial buildings. Anything 32 foot or wider, this is what they come with. So definitely a very strong building, but even cooler to look at as well. And just kind of see that structural engineering that goes into one of these buildings is unbelievable. These are what we call header bars. So essentially this section is gonna be closed in going into the center section right here what we did to remove these legs every four foot on this building we take the legs out of the base rail and we throw them up in the ceiling for support where we need the extra bracing since we don't have the legs for those supports we put them up in the ceiling we got a 14 by 14 another 14 by 14 right here and then if you come over here these are two 10 by 10 frame outs right here Going into another closed in section, going into our center section. And then right here, we're gonna put another end wall, have a walk-in door right here. And this will be an outdoor patio, kind of a place for us to hang out with our friends and get a nice view of the property. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed our install video. Next week, we'll be showing you guys the finished product. We'll be doing a walkthrough around the building, showing you a lot more uh, features and benefits of one of these buildings. If you're interested in getting one of these barns, give us a call, 800-244-4798. This is BigBuildingsDirect.com, here to give you the information you need so that you can get the metal building of your dreams.